Hey there! Today's physics game that I play is the energy types quiz where I will have to separate the kinetic energy and the potential energy on the two sides. So this exercise is only for these two type of energies where they have the actually the main type of energies. And so I have the objects here at the top. Uh, all right, 20 tries for good mark, so I must not uh, <laughs> move the objects a lot. So what I take, I have to place it, right? So the first thing, first object is uh, falling asteroid. What type of energy the falling asteroid represents? And because it is moving, it should be a kinetic, with the kinetic energy. And in general, uh, I, I can remember it this way, if the object is moving, uh, it should have the kinetic energy. If it, it is in, it, it, if it is not moving, in a relaxing, relaxing state, that should be, and it may be used for moving, that should be potential energy. And so the next one is the explosives. Now, the explosives are not moving, but they hold a lot bunch of potential uh, energy, so they should be just potential energy. The battery, it holds the energy inside it, but it is not moving, so it should be potential energy too. Uh, now, the sun. The sun is uh, a very controversial object. Uh, while I was exploring uh, the internet for this topic, I found the sun uh, is given either like kinetic energy or potential energy. But in general, I want to place it uh, in the potential and it will appear on the both sides. <laughs> so this actually is a quiz. Uh, I mean, it doesn't take effect for the tries. All right, the barrel of oil. Now, it is not moving, but we know oil can give liquids with that uh, moves other objects, so it is potential. Now the uppercut, this is in boxing, when this uppercut happens, it is definitely kinetic energy. The flying bullet also is maybe the most popular example of kinetic energy, of object with kinetic energy. Now, uh, here we have two apples. One is the apple on a tree. Now, it is in a relaxing state, so it is not moving, but it has the potential to fall, right? So, it is potential energy. And then the falling apple is actually the object with the kinetic energy. All right, the moving car, it's easy, kinetic. Now, now let's see, the stretched ball. So the stretched ball is just stretched, so the arrow is not flying, and it has the potential to launch the arrow, so it is potential energy. The coal is also potential energy, until it is on fire. <laughs> now the erupting, erupting volcano uh, should be kinetic uh, energy. But maybe before it is erupting, it is just potential. But because the lava is uh, radiate, the lava radiates heat. Maybe it can be also potential. Now there is the flying arrow. That is uh, definitely kinetic energy. The food. Now the food. Well, 
I will place it in the potential energy section because that hamburger, hamburger will give me a lot of energy to click on my mouse today. Now, the next one is the gunpowder. Until it is uh, not lighted, it should stay in the potential energy section. The steam flow, it is uh, fast moving particle, so it is kinetic energy. Uh, the wind is the, it's the last example of kinetic, ener kinetic energy. And finally, the water behind a dam. Well, until it is released, it will just stay into the state of potential energy. That is it. Well, I made it for 20 tries, so I can get a good mark for this uh, knowledge. Okay, this is for today, and let the force be with you.